Um, here we go. So, uh, and uh, the nominees for story are. Story. The Walking Dead. Oh, just for a month. Ha, the hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. Just you think stop panicking. Seriously, Ben. You need to stop and just take a breath. Thomas was alone. Chris was in love. She was perfect. He had to tell her so. Probably best to wait for a moment. The large, ominous pixel cloud wasn't about that. Far Cry 3. The only way off this island is to transform myself. See anything you fancy. Into something I never thought I could become. Dishonored. I will remind you that if your men spend time with any of our ladies, they have to pay. Yes, ma'am. Journey. Mass Effect 3. Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're going to be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, sir. I'm chuffed I'm saying this. And the BAFTA goes too. The Walking Dead! <laughs> uh, this is awesome. Thank you so much. Uh, this story probably wouldn't exist without a zillion other people. Uh, everybody at Telltale, every single person there contributed something to this story, whether it's a line of dialogue or a whole moment. Robert Kirkman, obviously. Dan and Kevin, like, let us tell a crazy story and never told us to stop, which is kind of insane. But uh, thank you so much. This is awesome. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Thanks to David and Melissa for being Lee and Clementine. Thanks to Kevin and Kirsten, our producers. Thanks to everyone who picked Walking Dead. Thanks to the Academy. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Real quick. <laughs> Joining me now, the winners of the Story Award, the team behind the fantastic game, The Walking Dead. Guys, you just won a BAFTA. Happy? Yeah, crazy. Fantastic. <laughs> yeah. So what does it take America's to write so a story like The Walking Dead? I mean, yeah. there's obviously so much uh, culture behind it. You've got the TV show and the comic books. Who wrote it? And uh, how? There's a group. I mean, uh, so Jake and I kind of came up with the story. The whole Telltale crew, like, throws in. We sit in a big room and we all fight about it. And uh, we wait until people are all arguing about what they would do in a given moment. And then we know we have a good thing. And then we all go home and cry. And we come into work the next day and we make a video game. That's how you do it. So there you go, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> it feels like the world of games and uh, films are kind of merging more and more as we progress down this route of sort of interactive enjoyment. Um, how does that play into what you guys do? How much does the, the TV show or the, or the comic book play a part in what you're making? Well, we're certainly built on being able to work with franchises and create an interactive experience that brings a whole other level to it. And I think when someone plays our game, they have a connection to the characters on a level that they can't get from non-interactive content. So when something happens, to a character. I've spent a lot of time, I've made decisions about that, and it brings a whole other level of storytelling. So we're really, really looking to continue to push that forward and, and take advantage of what interactive brings. So you guys are quite story focused, am I right? I mean, you make the Sam and Max franchise as well, is, correct. is that correct? Yeah, yeah. that's all we do. Yeah. Do you specialize in story? Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. in the interactive name, story. in the these Telltale guys founding in the name. It. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it must be a great honor to have won a BAFTA, right? It's oh, awesome. It's yeah. crazy. It's really, really crazy. Yeah. What's next from here? Uh, more video games at telltalegames.com cool. <laughs> slash store, <laughs> where you can buy them. And um, also there's merchandise on sale, I'm pretty sure as well, right? I'm just saying, games probably, video games. Yes, lots yes. of games. But uh, you know, we'll continue to tell good stories and work as hard as we can and try to make people is feel something like they did in The Walking Dead. So that's, Well, that's I can't wait to see what you guys come out with next. Congratulations, and uh, thanks for talking to me. Thank, Thank you so much. much. Thank you. Thank you.